methanogens are what produce the methane, which the cows then belch out, and that is a major greenhouse gas. One way that you can kind of decrease that methane production is adding nitrates to your feed. And I think they're looking at some seaweeds, they can reduce what a cow is producing um, in terms of emissions by about 80%, which is pretty incredible. My name is Tess, I'm a dairy farmer and veterinarian and we farm here at Benelli Jerseys in West Gippsland, Victoria. The way that we run this farm, it's, it's all about getting what we need out of it, but without compromising what the future generations can get out of it. So yeah, sustainability is a pretty important thing for me. We are running 550 Jersey cows to milk. That kind of equates to around 900 head on the farm in total. I feel like consumer expectations and, and meeting those is, is how you stay ahead and in touch and farm with a conscience. It's why I get up every morning and it's, it's really changed how we've farmed in the last five years and it's something I've really pushed for. Decreasing the grazing pressure on the farm um, means that you kind of keep carbon, nutrients, water in the soil, which is where we want it and which grows more feed. Um, a really key way that we do that is that nearly 100% of the farm is sown to permanent pasture. We do um, really regular soil testing. Um, beyond that, the rotational grazing, keeping that early growth stage of the grass means that cows make milk more efficiently, which means less emissions per cow for them producing that milk. I like to surround myself with as many animals as possible and I love looking after animals and they're the only things I really want to work with. <laughs>